I mean, one way to stay on top of it for companies is to keep abreast with the media, um, you know, effectively just staying up to date. There's a lot of reporting coming out based on the reports that are released um, to see if one of your known big suppliers is, is adversely mentioned. Checking or vetting clients and customers is a bit different. Typically, only regulated institutions like banks or lawyers will have so-called KYC or know your uh, customer checks in place. Uh, so non-regulated companies won't usually look at their clients to try and understand have they been implicated or not. Um, I'm by no means suggesting that non-regulated companies should go out and, and implement KYC. It's not a legal requirement and it may not be practical at all. Um, but if you are concerned as a company and you think that some of your customers or clients might be exposed, uh, exactly the same approach to vendors should be adopted. So if you don't already have it in-house, um, you know, taking your client list or your customer list and getting somebody to run it against a, a database and doing that check is, is the first step.